let's talk about circular dating and what if you date two guys who know each other or maybe even you get spotted on a date with somebody what should you do if you follow the way i teach you how to circular date it won't be an issue because honestly i don't think you should be even kissing a guy if you're just dating him until you get the commitment that you desire the exclusivity which for some women might be boyfriend girlfriend i'm not a fan of that um and for some other women it will be engagement okay so don't be weird about it it's just like you're dating those guys you're getting to know them and there's nothing wrong with it so even when you are dating two guys who know each other don't be weird about it because you're not doing anything wrong you're not doing a crime or anything um you know so basically just just be cool with it but but i i hear it can be a little bit weird um i was oh when you get spotted on a date like i got spotted on a date from another guy that i was dating and i was feeling really ashamed so i get it but the truth is there's nothing you have to feel ashamed of because um, you are just getting to know them, especially when you keep your boundaries of no kissing and no intimacy until exclusivity. You are just getting to know them like a friend. You go on innocent coffee, dinner dates, yeah? And actually, this even creates this sense of competition in men, this good tension. If they're interested in you, they will claim you like tomorrow. Be like, okay, what do I have to do for you to be exclusive with me? <laughs> yeah. So um, I actually had a situation where I had two dates scheduled in one day. And in between the dates, um, I met another guy. I was waiting for the other, for the next date. I met the third guy I was dating. And in this moment, I felt so weird. I didn't tell him the truth back then. It was years ago. But I should have. I should have told him the truth that, you know, I'm dating others. And um, yeah, and it's it's just innocent, right? Because if I would tell him the truth, I know for sure that he would like step up immediately and give me the ring. Yeah, because it happens so many other times with other men of my clients. If they are just cool about it, yeah. If um you know, I'm, I'm dating others. I'm, I'm dating for marriage until I am having the ring being proposed to. I'm going to be dating others. And um, even if you date two guys who know each other, that's even better. It's like competition, better tension. They will be like, oh, I want to take her off the market so much. Like men love competition. Masculine men, especially millionaires, they love competition. Like they like to know that they have competition and they want to take you off the market. So yeah, don't worry about this one. Also, I want to do a quick announcement. I have a new course for you, SOS plan if he's distant and withdrawn. This is for you. If your favorite guy makes you feel a little bit anxious and frustrated because he doesn't text and call so much, he feels a little bit distant and withdrawn, okay? So that you can become this confident, grounded magnetic woman again that will attract his attention back to you and you feel better in the moment the course is highly discounted link is in the description box and it's gonna be really really a helpful resource for you to have fun while dating okay to be a confident self that has multiple suitors and um that it leads to this millionaire's proposal Okay, thank you so much for watching, ladies. And let me know your thoughts in the comments about um, circular dating. And if you ever had the situation where you dated two guys who knew each other. <laughs> okay, bye-bye. See you in the next video.